Good morning, guys. Want to start this happy Mother's Day to everybody, your mother or not? Doesn't matter, I guess. Yeah, happy Mother's Day. Yeah. I'm not too sure what we're gonna do today, but we're gonna do something, anyways. Try to keep it a yoga theme, but it doesn't mean you're going to do yoga. <laughs> as long as you're breathing, you're doing your yoga. That's all that matters. Breathe with the attention, that's yoga. Breathe with movement. Arms up, palm together. Bring your arms back to the side. Nice deep inhale, arms up, palm together. Bring your arms back to the side. Breathe a little deeper. Inhale, arms up, palm together. Exhale, arms back to the side again. Couple more. Inhale, arms up, palm together. Exhale, arms back to your side again. Inhale, arms up, palm together. Exhale, arms back to your side. I'm going to add folding forward to this. Inhale, arms up, palm together. Exhale, fold forward all the way. Come back up all the way. Arms back to your side. Inhale, arms up, palm together. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, come back up. Exhale, arms back to your side. Inhale, arms up, palm together. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, open your arms, come up all the way. Exhale, arms back to your side. Inhale, arms up, palm together. Exhale, fold forward and hold. So you're teaching your body how to breathe. Don't lose that. Open your arms. Come up all the way. Exhale, arms back to your side. <clears throat> Inhale, arms up, palms together. Exhale, fold forward, palms on the ground. Inhale, look up, take your legs back all the way. Gently down, up the again, hand. Exhale, down, down. If you want to bend one knee at a time, you want to shift your hips to the left or right, it's the time to do it. Walk forward with your legs, fold forward, open your arms, come up all the way, big inhale, exhale, arms back to your side. Inhale, arms up, palm together. Exhale, fold forward, palms on the ground. Inhale, look up. Take your legs back all the way. Slow down, up the again. Exhale, down, down. Bring one leg in front, right leg in front, arms up, palm together. Hold it and breathe, couple deep breath again. Arms on the ground, take your legs back. Slow down, up the inhale, exhale, down. down. Other leg in front, arms up, palm together. Hold it and breathe, hold it and breathe, hold it and breathe. Palms on the ground again, take your legs back. Slow down, up the inhale. Exhale, down, down. Walk forward all the way with your legs. Fold forward, lift up your toes and ball of your foot. Place your hand 
You're standing on your own palm. Don't go on your rest. See if we can keep your knees straight. Rise your sit bones up higher even. Let's bring your attention to that. It's lifting. Stretch back of your knees. Shoulders away. Breathe deep. Breathe through your nose if it's still available to you. Let go of it. Bring your legs tighter together. Put your hands under your heels. Squat down low as much as needed. Keep the balance and then rise your sit bones up again. Let go of it again, please. Arms on the ground, take your legs back. Slow down, up dog, inhale. Exhale, down dog. Walk forward again with your legs. Fold forward. Grab opposite elbows in front or behind your leg, either or worse. Knees get a straight head. Open side of your rib cage, but the chest is still lifting. Don't try to squeeze your belly into too much of that. Let go of it. Palms on the ground. Take your legs back again. Gently down. Up dog inhale. Exhale down. Keep your right leg off the ground, rise it up. Come to high plank pose. Bring the knee to your elbow all the way. Back to down dog again. Lower your leg down, other leg up. Come to high, come to high plank pose, knee to elbow. Back to thumb dog again, lower it down, walk forward all the way, fold forward, open your arms, come up all the way, begin, exhale, arms back to your side. You're kind of guessing where we're going. Inhale, arms up, palms again. Exhale, fold forward, palms on the ground. Inhale, look up, take your legs back. Slow down, up dog, inhale. Exhale, down dog. Right leg off the mat. Rise it up, bring your knee to your elbow to the opposite side this time, and back to down dog again. Repeat that, go two, go three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten. Hold your low plank pose, please. Come back up to high plank pose. Walk forward with your legs. Fold forward. Open your arms. Come up all the way. Big inhale. Exhale, arms back to your side. Inhale, arms up, palms together. Exhale, fold forward, palms on the ground. Inhale, look up, take your legs back. Slow down, up dog, inhale. Exhale, down dog. Other leg off the ground, rise up. Come to high plank pose, knee touch opposite elbow, back to down dog again. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Go to low plank pose, please.
Oh. Come to high plank pose. Walk forward all the way. Fold forward. Open your arms. Come up all the way. Big inhale. Exhale, arms back to your side. So kind of we guess. That was Tabata work. That's what we're going to do. We did one. We're going to do seven more. So I'm now I'm going to time you. I'm going to time you. What, what, what? Okay, let's see what we do. Arms up, palms together. Exhale, fold forward, palms under. Inhale, look up, take your legs. Slow down, up dog, inhale. Exhale, down dog. From down dog, right leg up. Come 20 seconds, touching opposite elbow. Go. I'm timing you. Ten seconds to go. Go to low plank pose for ten seconds. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Come to high plank pose. Down dog, other leg. Go. Ten seconds. Low plank pose. Come to high plank pose. Walk forward with your legs. Open your arms. Come up all the way. Big inhale. Extra arms back to you. So that's the only extra thing we add to it. Every between two, gonna stand up and then we go again. Inhale, arms up, palms together. Exhale, fold forward, palms on the ground. Inhale, look up, take your legs back. Slow down, up dog, inhale. Exhale, down dog. Right leg up all the way. Going, time moving. Push it. Five, two, one, low plank. Ten, ten seconds, hold. High plank, down dog, other side. So it's ongoing time, we're going. Try not to catch up with the numbers, the time is going, it's going. 10 seconds. Done. Low plank. High plank. Other side. Walk forward. walk forward, walk forward. Let's walk forward, let's walk forward. Open your arms, come up all the way. On side. Exhale, arms back to your side. I forgot to be at that point. One more Yeah, one more each side. We did three already. Arms up, palms together. Exhale, fold forward, palms on the ground. Inhale, look up, take your legs. Slow down, up the again here. Exhale, down there. Right leg up, go one, two, three, four, five, six, done. Go on your forearms. Back to down dog again. Other leg, go. Time is moving. Three, two, one, done.
don't stand up for the game. <laughs> Walk forward, open your arms, come up all the way, big inhale, exhale, arms back to your side. We're going to do a couple other poses and we're going to have a couple more of those surprises. Arms up, palm pick. Exhale, fall forward, palms on the ground. Inhale, look up. Take your legs back all the way. Right leg off the mat as high as you can go without messing up your hips. Hips is this square. Now, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. Down on the ground, other leg up. Down on the ground. Walk back with your arms all the way. Fold forward. Grab opposite elbows behind your legs or in front of your leg, either or works. Open your arms, come up all the way, big inhale. Exhale, arms back to your side. Inner arms are palm together. Exhale, fold forward all the way, palms on the ground. Keep your right leg off the mat. Rise it up as high as you can. Let's move the leg in the air. Go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seven. On the ground, on the leg up. Go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Open your arms, come up all the way, begin, help arms touching. Exhale, arms back to your side. Arms up, palm together. Exhale, arms back to your side. Bring your right knee to your chest all the way. See if you can grab your big toe with index finger and mid finger. Hold it there. Just keep the balance going for now. If you have it in you, extend your leg forward. Bring the other hand on your hips to keep the balance a little better. If you have it in you again, take your leg to the side. Back to your center. Keep your leg there, both hands on your hips, and lower your leg down to the ground. Beautifully done. Inhale, arms up, palm together. Arms back to your side, and exhale. Bring the other knee to your chest. Reach out, grab your big toe. Extend your leg forward if you have it now. Bring your leg to the side. Back to your center, hands on your hips. Lower your legs. Next one, we're going to do Spider-Man launch. We're going to add a right angle to it. So, inhale, arms up, palm together. Exhale, fold forward, all the way, palms on the ground. Inhale, look up. Take your legs back all the way. Slow down, up dog, inhale. Exhale, down dog. Bring your right leg in front, arms up, palm together. That's what it is. I'm going to add a right angle to this. So my back heel is on the mat. My back foot's about a 45 degree angle. And I'm just bringing, you can have forearm on your knee, but you don't want to have any weight on that arm. You want to try to hold yourself up with core strength, spine strength. So if you can, drag the forearm down the inner calf. And then we're gonna go hold, we're gonna go to a palms on the ground to the lounge again. 
Take your back heel off the mat. And we're going to come back up all the way to the side. Okay. We're going to do 20 seconds of this. You're going. Ground. going. Keep going. <laughs> Keep on repeating it. Keep on repeating it. <laughs> and time is over. Go on your forearms again. Lizard pose. Yeah, lizard pose. So you're still in a fireman lunge position. You can hold it here. You can even drop your back leg knee to the mat. Or you might want to try coming onto your forearm. Chest lifting up. Come back up. We're going to take it to the other side. So just bring the other leg in front. So you're going to back heel on the mat. Right angle pose. Palms on the floor. Back heel off the mat. Back heel on the mat. Back heel off the mat. Just working. As I'm doing right angle, I'm rotating my torso to the wall behind. Opening my chest to the Ceiling to the sky, outsider in. Inhale, exhale. And done. I'm going back on the floor. Okay. Find your way into lizard. You pop your back leg knee down, top of the foot on the floor. As long as you're trying to focus on lifting the chest forward, you don't want to round the spine. You want to get into the posture, but spine first so that you lift your breastbone. You might find you can't go on your forearms because it's too tight. As long as you keep your chest lifted, eventually, with chest lifted, you can get on those forearms. Back of the neck, important spot. Keep some length. Don't keep your head in extension. Chin in neutral. Drop the head forward. Tailbone lengthening back. Okay, you got the idea. Stand up again, please. We're going to do, we come forward all the way. We're going to do eight of those, eight of those, four left, four right. And then we're going to do basically 20 seconds, 10 seconds, 20 seconds, 10 seconds. Get set, arms up, palm together. Exhale, four, four, palms on the ground. Inhale, look up. Take your legs back to all the way. Slow down, up dog, inhale. Exhale, down dog. Bring your right leg in front to the lunge, and here we go. Go all the way to right angle. Keep going. Time is moving now. Keep moving in and out of those two postures. Right angle. Spider-Man. Five seconds gone. Follow your breath. Ten Inhale, gone. Inhale, lengthen the chest. Exhale, back to lunge. Inhale. Fifteen gone. Done. Ten seconds hold. Done with this two, take it to the other side, please. You step back and switch, or you can jump switch. As I go to right angle, I am pressing up and through my feet. I'm rising. I'm lifting. I'm aware of my back foot heel. As I go to right angle. And done. Back on your forearm. This is our number two finishing. Done. Other side again. Number three is start. 20 seconds. Done. And your four arms. Squeeze your back, extended leg glute, tighten your glute. Done. Number four.
Done. Done. Number five is starting. Done. I'm still pressing my big toe pad on my front foot into the floor. Done. Number six. Nice spinal twist on that right angle. Done. Ten second hold. Two more to go, guys. Done. Keep rotating nice. Make sure you're manipulating the muscle in your hips. You're lifting your heel off the ground. Hips get square to the ground and get all the way forward. Don't just rotate the arm. Done. Ten second hold. Done. Last one. Done. Low plank. Done. Take down dog again. Walk forward all the way. Fall forward. Open your arms. Come up all the way. Big inhale. Exhale arms back to your side. We'll do another couple of other poses and then we'll go find something to deal with that. Arms up, palm together, please. Exhale, fold forward, palms on the ground. Be there, be there. See if we can bring your palms on the ground now. See if we can keep your fingers pointing back now, palms to the ground. Rise your sit bones up, breathe deep. Fold it and breathe, fold it and breathe. Open your arms, come up all the way, big inhale. Hold it there, lean to your left side all the way. Hold and breathe, hold and breathe. Back to your center, go other side, hold. Keep on breathing, keep on breathing. Back to your center, bring your hands on your knees, swan long, open side of your rib cage, front chest lifting. Keep on breathing now. I'm just sending my heels out a little bit without moving them, more of a just a torque on the ground. Flare the sit bones. And um, see my shoulders rolled back and down. We're going to do come back up all the way, please. We're going to do a courtesy lunge, courtesy lunge, and then come out of it. We're going to do a few of those, same leg over and over. 
and then we're going to add to this and then we're going to find something to deal with this three four and five let's do the other side go one two it's a launch have to stay as square as you can and then let go outside three there's quite a bit of weight on my back toes four and into my front heel and five good now we're going to add side kick to this so we're going to go all the way to the launch same leg going to kick to the side side kick and same leg goes to the lunge. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Take it to the other side. Go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm gonna hold the down dog for a few seconds. Come forward again. That's the one we're gonna do it. So I'm gonna do that 20 seconds, I'm gonna go all the way to the courtesy launch, side kick, and then other side, and then take a down dog. Ready? Set, let's go. Time moving. 20 seconds. Ten seconds to go. Time is over for this. We go other side. We go other side. One. Ten seconds. Done. Take it down, dog. Ten second hold. Come out of it. So we did two. We got uh, six more to go. So get set. Go. Five seconds. Done. Three side. And done. Take it down, dog again. Back up again, please. Get set. Go. Done. Other side.
Five second. Done. Back to Don Dog with the six. Two more to go. To walk the hips out here, straighten one knee, bend the other. A lot of hip stabilizing we're doing in this exercise. Come forward again and stand up. Last Go. On each side. As you get warm and give it a good depth to it. Three, two, one, done. Other side, go. Ten seconds. And done. Take it down, dog again. Take a child pose quickly for like a few seconds. Walk with your arms to your left side. Back to the center, walk to the other side, continuously moving. Keep on moving, keep on moving, keep on moving. Reach forward as you move, reach forward as you move. And that's it, stand up. We're gonna work on warrior two, and then we're gonna add to that. See, we can add triangle to that, and then when we finish, we're gonna see if we can add some split to this. But till then, bring your legs together, stand up tall, arms up, palm together. Take your right leg back all the way to warrior two. Front heel to intersect with your back arch of your foot. It helps to place the hips and knees in one like uh, line. Shoulders roll back and down, chin is neutral, neck is long, top of the head lifting, elbow lengthening. So this equal opposite pull through the spine, equal opposite pull through the arms. As I reach out, you can also turn palms up to help open the shoulder. My shoulder blades are slightly going inward as my arms reach outward. Take it to triangle all the way. So front knee is straight, hand go on your machine, on your knee, but don't load your leg. So just touch, it's a desired touch. My kneecap is lifting to create strength around my knee. Palm can be on the ground. You can readjust your back leg. Look down on the mat, palms on the mat, take your legs back, slow down, up the inhale, exhale, down dog. Bring the other leg in front of this. Arms open to warrior two, reach out. I like my palms up, I like to create that space. Going all the way to triangle again, one more time. I'm straightening my front knee as I'm lifting my kneecap up. I'm bending as much as I need to in order to get that stretch from the inner leg. Everybody is going to be different. Just make sure that we don't send the bum back. So there's this nice external rotation happening on this front thigh to keep the hip and knee and ankle in one long line. Now we're adding a nice rotation from navel up, including neck and head as we twist. Palms on the ground again, take your legs back. Gently down, up, dug, inhale. 
extra dunker. So bring the other leg in front to warrior two and changing it all quickly to triangle for 20 seconds. So we're going now, we're going now. Hold it and go. Three. Well, after 20 seconds of this, which is eight seconds gone, we're gonna take it all the way to a split. Two, one, done. Going all the way to a split. Which side split is a better one right now, which is you already there, it's available to you. Holding it. You don't want to do four. It's so tough for you right now. Bend your back leg knee and um, focus on lifting the bum bones up and back. Slight dip in the low back. Front foot is flexed. Top foot is reaching for your shin and your shoulders are rolled back. There's a nice fork here in your arm. Biceps forward. There's a lot of information here. Just pick up what you can. And done. We're going to all go other side. So come out of it. You jump switch. Your step switch. To warrior, warrior two, two, all the way to triangle. Knee straight. Reach. Go. In a separate talk, we're going to actually speak about these poses and body hold and the techniques. Three, two, one, done. Then you got to have some reference. Find your level of split. You're working with your body, right? This is your time. And yes, we're talking about your split, whatever it means to you. Done. Two is gone already. That's number three. Make sure you're breathing. And nothing gonna disturb that nice deep breathe. Done. Split again. Two, one, out of it. Probably hold a little longer, but. When you go to triangle, I don't straighten that knee with a kneecap lift. So use your quad muscle to come into your triangle. Don't push into the back edge of your knee. Support that back part with lifting the quad. Quad is contracting. Three, two, one, done. That's our number four, we're finishing. Done, come out of it. Try to squeeze the inner thighs towards each other. Coming out of the split. We go on the side. We make it 20 and 20 second hold. So what is for the split two? 20, 20 rather than 20, 10. Seems correct, seems right there. Done. It's number five. We've got three more to go. So I'm also playing with my upper arm, forearm. I'm just taking my palms back, fingers, sorry, fingers back, palms forward. Trying to open through the front of my wrists. That's it. Done. Go other side Knees, now. Knees, legs together. Number six. Five seconds. 
Done. Open and hold. Probably fully warmed up. We feel a lot better. Even though it doesn't look much different, the feeling is coming. That's beginning of the looks too. Done. Two more to go. One left, one right, or one right, one left, whichever you start. Go. So I'm pivoting at the hip. I'm not moving my spine. My spine is collapsing. Okay. My spine is neutral. Hip flexion, hip extension. A little bit of flexion too. We're just moving from the hip joint. Done. Done. One more other side, and that's it. That's it. We go. Because you know, this is your body guiding you. Hopefully, just hang out if you need to. Something feels good. Do it. Done. Yes. So last one, guys. You can move the foot, pivot the front foot around, see what angle you need to get at. Maybe more inner thigh hamstring, more hamstring central or outer hamstring. So you just feel so you need to find that stretch. That's done. Take your leg back. We're going to work on the hero and rabbit. Hero and rabbit. So bring your knees down all the way. For now, see if you can actually sit on your heels. Bring your legs together at first and see if you can sit on your heels. But if you have it, keep your legs apart. See if you can sit between your legs. So it's a lot of demand on the body if you haven't done it. Almost impossible. Bring your knees closer to each other. Bring your palms on your heels and then go on your elbows. Reach back. Come back forward. We're gonna go all the way, put our top of our head on the ground, reach out for your heel, rise your bum up. Do not load your head. There is no load on the head, is just gentle touch. And then with your knees, walk toward your forehead while you're rising your bum up. Squeeze your heels together and come out of it. I'm gonna go back again. I'm gonna go back again. Walking back. I want to do a couple of those while I'm talking here myself. Here, if I get this stuck, I'll let you guys know. <laughs> Try to encourage a back bend in this if you can. If you have a couple of books, if you find that you're not able to sit your bum down or yoga blocks, sit on those and then try to put fingers on heels, palms of hands on pads of feet and try to lift the chest up. Come back up. Let's go back to rabbit. Crown of your head is on the floor. So hear me, don't look at me. Crown of your head is on the floor. You're going to reach around and grab the arches of your feet from the outside end. Then you're going to walk your knees as close to your forehead as you can, preferably touching. 
You're going to squeeze your heels together and you're going to pull on your feet to take pressure off your head and neck as you rise your bum bones to the ceiling. Just hold and breathe. Come back up. So I felt that around my tailbone, so that's as much as you get. You might have felt that in your neck or head or anywhere. Open your legs again. We go through this two more times each. Find your challenge for hero pose. Doesn't matter if you're sitting on something this tall, okay? You're working to where you need to go to increase the depth of this stretch, bit by bit. Try to keep your knees pushing down to the floor, squeeze them together, and tongue on the top of your mouth. Teeth are apart and lips are together. Stretching the front of the throat. Make sure your teeth are apart. Don't clench your teeth. Come out of it. Push up, straight spine, and then back to lab it. I'll talk you through top of the head on the floor. Grab the arches of your feet. Walk your knees to touch your forehead. Squeeze your heels together. Pull on your feet as you rise your bum bones. Good core work here as you scoop the belly in and up under the rib cage. Use the core to help open the spine even more. And slowly come up, vertebrae by vertebrae, head last to come up. And we're going to go one more time to each. So these are postures that we might avoid, we might not like to do. But they're needed. This is a good way to sit, despite what people might say. Push yourself back up one more time to grab it. You go in on your own. Work step by step. Come out over the game, please. Extend your arm forward. If your arms walk to your left side all the way. Come back to your center. Walk to the other side, please. Come back to your center again, please. That's it for now. Again. Thank you, guys. Happy Thank Mother's you. Day again. Enjoy your day. And make sure you subscribe.